Hola Capricorn Capricorns! This is what the reading you're waiting for. This is your 2018 Sun Moon reading. Um, when you view this reading is when you were meant to see it, even though it is 2018 and throughout the year. It can be a blip in time or it can be a longer period of time in 2018. It's just a little something to look out for. Um, the first portion of this is free, okay? So I will just lay the card, I will give you a description of what a Capricorn Capricorn is. After that, I will shuffle and lay the cards out. If you want further clarification or you want the full reading, I'll put, paste the link below in Vimeo and you can go into Vimeo and you can have me read the rest of the cards for you. Or if you just want to look up the cards yourself, which some people might want to do and try to figure it out, that's fine. But if you want my interpretation plus clarifiers, you will need to go into Vimeo to see the rest of the video, okay? Please have patience in regards to these video, um, videos. I'm doing 144 readings. And I'm just, I really don't have any rhyme or reason to them. They're just going to be going uploading as they upload. Keep in mind if you need a quick answer, <coughs> go to my Instago. I'm on Instago, Veronica Garnet. You can get a quick question there. I will answer you very quickly. I try to do it within a day if possible, okay? Oh, excuse me. So Capricorn Capricorns, this is your astrological profile for being a Capricorn Capricorn. You're a solemn person, you give off a wise image, you're somewhat introverted and pensive. Common sense is one of your greatest assets. You seem to have an awareness that goes beyond space and time. You're mostly respected and admired because, because others see a great maturity in you. You most likely recall a lot of rules and regulations and not much love and affection when you reflect on your childhood. Very early in life, too, you doubtless had to accept a lot of responsibility and it stopped you from having as much fun as the other kids. This is possibly one cause of why you have a somewhat discontented attitude. For you, life is a permanent struggle and as a result, you can be cold and you can be very cunning. The lack of support and acceptance you required as a child almost certainly drove you to prove yourself to the rest of the world because of the burden of your early responsibilities. You're resolute to triumph over whatever reverses your encounter in life, or whatever you encounter in life, and you're very ambitious as well. Your combination implies tremendous inner strength, determination, and resolve. Your material, material success is rarely accompanied by emotional satisfaction, but your rise in the world is methodic. You're never happy with your achievements, and you always want more standing, more reputation, and more riches. The challenge is to have greater concern and human compassion. Don't let a career substitute for love or be an option to everything else in life. Expand and try to appreciate others instead of applying power or position to guard yourself from others. Furthermore, you should attempt to be more understanding and unbiased in your dealings with others. Your stubbornness is mesmerizing, and when you meet the opposition, you do so head on overcoming your adversaries with level-headedness and sometimes carelessness. You're always prepared, and your mind is reasonable and accurate. Your credo is effectiveness, and the strength of perception intrinsic to your combination can be centered, can be centered to creative endeavors. Your magnificent sense of humor, although very imaginative and generally serious. Consequently, you have a dry liking for the darker and satirical sides of life, most double Capricorns are attracted to well-planned order professions. Your ease when taking when risk taking is at a minimum, and when you have rules to follow, which makes you well suited for corporate or bureaucratic positions. So I will lay out your 2018 reading. Here we go. Holy Spirit, angels, divine guides, universe, can you please provide your truth, your clarity, your wisdom, and your insight? Ooh. For Capricorn, Capricorns, Capricorn Sun, Capricorn Moons for the year 2018. Can you show us what surrounds them at their present time? Can you show them what energies they left last year? Can you show us what the Capricorn Sun Capricorn Moons have coming in the new year 2018? Can you show us where Capricorn Sun Capricorn Moon should focus their energies? And then finally, what will be the general outcome for them in 2018? Please grant me the objectivity to read these cards as they're intended to be read and to say your messages ooh, as you intend them to be said for Capricorn Sun, Capricorn Moons for the year 2018. I'm using the Cosmic Tarot deck for this reading, and I'm using the Secret Tarot for clarifiers. Alrighty, let's see what's going on. 
Hi, Spirit Angels. Can you please show us what is surrounding Capricorn Sun, Capricorn Moons at this present time? They're pulling the Nine of Wands. Can you show us the influences they left last year? What are the influences that they left last year? Or what did they leave in last year, 2017? We have the Sun card. What's coming for Capricorn Sun, Capricorn Moons in the new year, 2018? We have the Seven of Wands, and then where should they focus their energies on 2018? Where should they focus their energies in 2018? Alrighty, you guys have the King of Pentacles in reversed. And then finally, what will be their general outcome for 2018? We have the King of Wands in reverse. Okay, so again, to go over what surrounds you in the present, we have the Nine of Wands in the upright. What left you or what you're leaving in 2017 is the Sun card in the upright. What's coming in the new year is the Seven of Wands in the upright. Your energy or focus your energies should be... Oh, Focusing your energies on the King of Pentacles in reverse. And then finally, for the general outcome, we have the King of Wands in reverse. Okay? I'm going to continue this reading with clarifiers in the Vimeo link that I'm going to leave below. But uh, for some of you, if you would like to go ahead and kind of look this up or what have you, feel free to do so. Um, my, my own interpretation is going to be in the Vimeo radio, <laughs> Vimeo reading. So hopefully I'll see you over there. Adios from Veronica Garnett. Adios.